Here's the Sakura 4-in-1 punch, and you can do all these four designs. You've got um, no insert. This is with the A insert, which are these. The corner, with the B insert, and then the third insert, C, will have a decorative corner without the sharp edge here. So I'm going to show you how to do these four different punches. So I've got my paper here, and you kind of want to use just regular paper, not cardstock, because um, that might damage the punch. So you're just going to slide in your paper. I'm going to do a border here. And press down. And there's your first punch. And um, you space the designs evenly apart by lining up the center of the design with the edge of the punch. So I'm going to line that up with the center, kind of with that dot there. And then press down. And do the same with the second one. And you basically just go along the whole edge using that uh, centering technique. Now the second border design you can do is with these a inserts and they have plastic letters on them uh, to make you, to let you know which ones they are. So I'm going to use the other side of my paper here and just start at the end and it'll just give you the flower with the lines. So you're going to do the same thing as you did before, just lining up the center of your design and pressing down. And it's very quick and very easy to do. So that's with the A insert. Now we're going to do some corner designs. I'll put in the B insert. Just they slide in the sides here. Very easy to install. Slide in your corner so they're touching the guides. Press down and there's the design you get. Now with the C insert You've got a different shaped corner. Slide in your corner, press down, and there's your shaped corner. Now this looks really nice on its own or layered on top of a different colored paper. Um, lots of different things you can do with that. Perfect for cards, for pages. And that's your Sakura 4-in-1 punch.